Hey girlfriends, it's Tish B, and I am creating this video for you tween moms and friends and family members of tweens to help you get started with your child's period kit. Yes, this came sooner than I thought it would, but as I was putting together my tween's period kit, I said, let me turn on the camera and share it with you rock star moms and friends of tweens. Let's get started. My tween was with me when we were searching for bags and we came across this bikini pouch. Um, she loved the colors in it and it will definitely get her through the summer before we start scouting out something for school to start. But I love the size of this and for what we want to put in it, I think that it's going to be able to house everything. Uh, we got this at Walmart for $3.97 and if you um, want to get something like this, it'll be perfect for monogramming or leaving as is. Let's see what goes inside. I bought the Always Radiant with Flex Foam pads and the patterns are perfect for teens and tweens. These intimate wipes I picked up at the Dollar Tree. They are great and compact enough for cleanup time. And flushable wipes. Now these didn't come from Dollar Tree, they are a Walmart brand. We're going to put extra undies in her kit. And I also picked up these small individual packs of Advil and we're going to check with her school nurse to see if she needs to let her nurse handle these while she's going through that special moment. And at Dollar Tree, I saw these medicated patches for tummy aches and cramps. So I think that they will be work on her tummy, we'll see. Some of these items may be taken away from the kit as time progresses. Some things may be added. We're just trying it out. So we know we're not going to leave out the chocolate, right? So I let her pick out the chocolate that she wants into her kit. And we're going to include some feminine spray in the kit. and she wanted something else that smelled good. And she can either spray this after washing up or just spray it in the air to make sure the room smells fresh. And we're gonna put in a small size of deodorant in there for extra cleanliness and freshness. And at Dollar Tree, they had these small little lip balms or petroleum jellies. When I was at the Dollar Tree, I saw these little tins at the checkout and I knew that I could possibly do something with these. I love the size of them, so I picked up two so that I can open up one and start to play around with it to see what we could put in here. So on the inside of it, as is, you get a hair tie, a nail file, a little bitty sewing kit. I don't know if my child would know what to do with this. And stain removing wipe. And two large bobby pins. It's a pretty nice size kit with some contents for a dollar. But I think that we can add some more of our previously purchased items into this little tin that would be perfect for concealing what's in it. You can put a pad in there. And when I was at the Dollar Tree, I saw this cute notebook. My daughter loves notebooks just as much as I do. And this is a great time for her to journal her thoughts. And I love the saying, dream big, set goals, and take action. So she will keep this along with her so she can jot down her happy thoughts, her not so happy thoughts. And this journal book has 80 sheets in it. And again, this came from the Dollar Tree. Love it. These little panty liners will also fit perfectly in the emergency fashion kit tin that I got from the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to stuff a few things in here just to give you an idea of how wonderful this little tin can play a part. First, I wanna show you how all of the items that we purchased fits great into the larger bag. 
that was initially a bikini pouch, but we're making it our tween period kit. And most of our items are already in here. The notebook is not going to go in here. This is for her just to keep in her purse or her backpack. And one other thing that we're going to include is a Ziploc bag for her to keep on hand just in case she spoils her underwear and she can place them in here if she chooses not to discard the underwear. So now back to that little tan. I am going to show you the items that we're going to place back in here that will still work out and be a good match to put in the period kit. So I'm going to put the Ziploc bag in here, the panty liners, the packet of Advil that we're going to make sure will be allowed on campus, chocolate, let's give her two, and the nail file will go back, the hair tie, and the little sewing kit. Now, I don't think she's gonna use it, but I'm gonna include it in there because I may just be surprised. Let's tuck it under there. It's not that important, right? And the last thing that I'm going to put in here is the little petroleum jelly. Just fit it in there like a little puzzle piece, and everything actually fits great in here. So if you see these at Dollar Tree, definitely pick this up to add to your kit to use as additional storage. And I think it's gonna go in here, yep, just right. It's not overstuffed in this bag, and this will be great to keep in her backpack or her locker. And if she needs to go and change, she can take this cute little bag along with her, and it'll be compact enough to hang on the door hanger in the bathroom. Perfect. Any small size bag will be great for your child to take to school to use in their locker, keep by their desk, put in their purse. And as you can see, with all of the items that she will need during this delicate time, will fit great into this bag. The notebook will not go in the period kit, but I do encourage my tween to jot down her thoughts, whether they're happy or not so happy, especially during this time when emotions are all over the place. I want her to document those. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you love something that I've shared in this period kit video, please let me know down in the comment box. I'd love to hear from you. And I just wanna say thank you so much for taking the time to see what I've included in my tweens period kit. I can also be found on Instagram at I am Tish Bullard and my business page at Tish Bullard Events. If you're not already an official girlfriend of this channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and click subscribe and there's a little bell right next to that button. Press that and you will be notified of upcoming videos that I'll post here on my channel. I thank you so much for taking the time to watch this and until next time, design and live the life that you love. Bye.